this is where I last saw him. You, teenage you. You were headed this way, arm in arm with Edna. Ugh. Luckily, my erstwhile wife was never the type to kiss on a first date. If we work fast and stay focused, we can see to it that there, I mean, our relationship never moves beyond the hand-holding stage. Well, will you look at that? The old town theater. Much now. Very cool. I haven't thought about this place in years. The missus made me tear it down back in 71. Said the movies were corrupting the younger generation. It was all nonsense, of course. I spent countless evenings here in my youth, and it never turned me into a hoodlum. Say, remember Public Enemy? Why, you dirty rat, no good yellow bellied stool? I never did manage to see Frankenstein, though. Oh, i 그래서 혹시 프랭크슈타인 보러 온 건가? 그래서 That's what we're here for. We've got to get young you to see Frankenstein. Right, of course. The film that was supposed to set off a chain reaction in my imagination, inspiring with a notion that would launch my science. You still got no memory of what that notion was? Oh, 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 it happened in the brain of a different Emmett Brown. An Emmett Brown now erased by the shifting sands of time. Luckily for us, I do know something about my own brain, having lived in it for the past 70 plus years. Once we get my younger self re inspired by that movie, nothing will distract him from his proper. <gasps> Great Scott, will you look at that? The town square? It's just like I remember it, only dirtier. Oh! The old courthouse. Come on now, Doc. You need to go inside oh. and check it out. First rule of time travel, Doc. Never allow your other self to catch sight of you. It could cause reality to collapse or something. You mean? Right behind you. Don't peek. Go on. I'll let you know when you're gone. And don't forget your Carl Sagan. The billions and billions guy? The suspected arsonist. Huh? Just go with it. Ah. French time Oh, Sonny! You do show up at the oddest moments. Where have you been hiding? Oh, you know, here and there, you're a little hard to pin down yourself. I went looking for you last night, but I believe I was off entertaining a beautiful lady. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I never really got a chance to thank you. Well, I'm sure you would have escaped Kid on your own. Kid? Oh, sure, I'm grateful for that, but no, I'm talking about Edna. It's funny to think of now, but until that crisis, I actually thought Edna and I disliked one another. <laughs> Imagine! Uh... Yeah, well, girls are great and all, but don't get carried away. <laughs> the thing is, you shouldn't let Edna distract you from, you know, the business at hand. Finishing your project for the expo and going to see Frankenstein. Oh, pshaw. I'm far too busy for movies these days. But, uh... And as for my project, it's practically done. The rocket car? The rocket car? Boy, are you out of date. I've junked a rocket car. But more trouble than it's worth. I'll never figure out a propulsion system that does what I want it to do. And besides, its social utility is practically non-existent. Social utility? Since when do you care about... The mental alignment meter is a much more worthy project. The what? It was Edna's idea, and she's really been cracking the whip to get me to complete it in time for the expo. Emin, I'm a little confused here. What day is it? Why, it's opening day! The opening day of the expo! Which reminds me, I'd better skedaddle back to the lab. If Edna catches me dawdling, there'll be heck to pay! Catch you around, Crockett! October 12th! Doc? Huh! The time is completely... Oh, it's gone. Is this the time? 
여기 주민이 돼 있네 이거. The DeLorean should still function adequately as a means of conveyance in the first three dimensions. What? Huh? 3차원? 무슨 말이야? What's that? Hill Valley High School? You were right. There she is. My soon-to-be ex-future wife is nothing if not predictable. Do I really have to talk to her? I mean, couldn't I just hang out until you fix the time circuits and... Oh! I'll talk to her. <laughs> You'd better get the DeLorean out of sight before someone... Hey, you! Quit blocking the drive! All car of the future contestants need to report to the North Tent! Oh... Why not? Good luck! I shouldn't go anywhere until I've talked to Edna. Ah. Edna, what is it? Hey, Artie. Officer. Officer? Oh, right. Don't blow your cover. Will you please keep your mind on the task at hand? Can't talk right now. Oh, Edna. Spell it B R O W N. It's not exactly an obscure name. I still don't see it on the list. I'm sorry. Oh, for the love. Let me try this one more time. This is the Hill Valley Science Expo, right? First annual. Indeed. The purpose of our fair is to showcase cutting-edge technology. That's right, and to burnish Hill Valley's reputation as a forward-thinking community. And yet, you want to exclude the maker of the most revolutionary breakthrough of all. It's not that I want to, but... Oh, dear. Mr. Crockett! You do pop up at the oddest times. What are you doing here? I need to... Whatever it is, I hope you don't have to deal with Mr. Stonewall here. His sole function seems to be preventing people from accomplishing their business. Honestly, with him keeping the books, it's a wonder the Tannen gang got as far as they did. Uh, have you seen Emmett? Uh, I know. Uh, no. Oh, then you've heard all about his big breakthrough, the mental alignment meter. Isn't it exciting? And to think, he didn't even realize the import of his discovery until I pointed it out to him. I've never known anyone like him, so oblivious to his own potential. I kind of wanted to talk to you about Emmett and his potential. Funny, I didn't spot it myself at first. In fact, for the longest time, I thought I didn't even like him. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Edna's future is so bright. 아, you know, a lot of guys start out with great potential and then sort of run out of steam. That's what I'm here for, to make sure he goes the whole distance. Oh. Yeah, but... I appreciate your concerns, Mr. Crockett, but I can take care of myself. 
I know what I'm looking for in a man, and it so happens Emmett fits the bill to a T. Oh. That's Emmett Brown. Rhymes with clown, which I'm beginning to think you are. Just a simple mix-up, I'm sure. I've no doubt of that. Oh. Ahem. <clears throat> You said that Emmett fits your bill of requirements for a man. Yes. What would that list be exactly? You'd make a good reporter, Mr. Crockett. You know that? Well, his physical appearance for one thing. Emmett may not be Clark Gable, but he cleans up surprisingly well. I gave him my grandfather's white suit to wear at the expo. Oh, you should see him in it. He looks positively radiant. Looks good in a suit. Got it. And he's completely devoted to me. That's important. I've got or... no time or tolerance for playboys. Faithful as a Labrador. Check. Thirdly, and most important... Yes? Well, his mind, of course. It's brilliant, and it's virtuous through and through. His own mind map shows him to be a model citizen. Good brain. Oh, I see. Oh, oh. And citizen. if it turned out that you were mistaken about any of these qualities... Say, what's your game? Just curious, just trying to understand the female mind. Well, understand this. I'm not some faint-hearted girl who'd run away at the first hint of trouble. I've made a big investment in Emmett. Not money, but I've sunk all my ambitions into him. I'd have to be thoroughly disillusioned before I'd call it quits with Emmett. Got it? Uh-huh. Now, Mr. Cub Reporter, is there anything else? Manchi. Hmm... What the heck is this mental alignment Chum -chum meter of Emmett's? Oh, it's an absolutely revolutionary invention! Measures a person's affinities, what he's attracted to, what he's repulsed by, that sort of thing. Interesting. Ooh. And it really works? Well, of course! What's the point of inventing something that doesn't work? Or, anyway, it works well enough for my purposes. Your purpose is... Ah, Rather hard right. for me to picture Emmett as a chick magnet. Chick magnet? A guy who gets the girls, you know, motors running. Motors? Who makes them, y you know. You mean a chic? Yeah. Well, it's a matter of taste, I suppose, but when he's properly pomaded and decked out in my grandfather's hmm. white suit, Emmett just glows. Makes my heart flutter a bit just to picture him. You say you know Emmett is a model citizen, but you don't know him as well as I do. Did you know he once cheated some Libyans out of plutonium? Plutonium? What would Libyans want with plutonium? I'm sure he had a very good reason. Emmett's mind map demonstrates conclusively his brain is oriented toward virtue. Ah. This one time, to power one of his science experiments, Emmett hijacked a train. Please, there hasn't been a train hijacking in Hill Valley since the days of Mad Dog Tannen. Or... Emmett's no. done a lot of shady things in this time. My vice principal warned me to stay away from him. Your vice principal sounds like a dolt. Hmm. Emmett's done a lot of shady things in this time. My <laughs> vice principal warned me to stay away from him. <laughs> Your vice... So you say Emmett only has eyes for you? Absolutely. It's almost embarrassing how devoted he is to me. Well, it's good to hear he's finally settling down. Yes. <laughs> settling down? You know, ready to stop playing the field, as it were. Playing the... Oh, you're joking! It but I can't help there. feeling sorry for him. Who? All of Emmett's other girls, now that he's with you. Please, I think I know Emmett by now. There are no other girls. Ha <laughs> ha. I wonder what's going to happen to Emmett's Little Black Book. Little Black Book? Oh, it's legendary. That's what enabled Emmett to become the, uh, Valentino of Hill Valley High. <laughs> Gee, I wonder if he'd let me have it. You must think I'm pretty gullible, Mr. Crockett. Ah, here we go. It's not the end. Here we go. That's all the questions I got. Very well, then. Oh, the mood is not good. Ooh. Hey, Artie. You seen my Orioli? You mean this? Yeah, thanks. Oh, 
she gets to come and go freely, and I'm forced to wait. I love it. Hmm. Hey, excuse me. Yeah? When does the expo Not open? Not till tonight. Anybody without official business here, please get off the grounds! You got official business here? Yeah. Well, stay out of the way of the workers. You look familiar. Do I know you? Uh, nope. <laughs> Hello. To all who approach these hallowed halls, I bid thee welcome. Uh, to all who approach these hallowed halls, I bid thee welcome. To all who... Oh, hiya, kid. Say, aren't you the fellow who... Got you to turn on Kid Tannen? You bet. You look younger without your mustache. That was a dirty trick, you know, making me think Kid had gone and iced Artie. I'm sorry, but it was the only way I could... Ah, uh, forget about it. I'm trying to. Yesterday's in the past. That's my motto. You gotta live for today. Ooh. Right. So what are you doing down here anyway? Do you wish to pull the levers that control the future? Ah. Uh. At the expo, silly. Technology for a better tomorrow and all that. Oh, uh, yeah, that's actually why I'm here. Come on, Ah. Expo Whose idea was it to put a science and technology expo in Hill Valley? Pete's me. Audie says it's all bread and circuses. But I ain't seen a single clown yet today. You got it, Dago? So, who are you supposed to be? Don't you know your Homer? I am Techni Muse of Progress. You can tell by the lightning bolts. Must have slept through that class. I'm supposed to be a goddess like. I'm the one who inspires all the great men who make the discoveries. And women, too. Leave us not forget Madame Curie. I never would. So, you work for the expo? Yeah, ain't it a kick? I greet all the important guests. And on the final day, I get to bestow the golden sundial on the winning contestant. How's kid's trial going? Slowly. You know what they say. The wheels of justice grind slowly, but infinitely fine. Except in Hill Valley, where they don't move at all. What? Nothing. It's just, you know, something I heard once. So no regrets about turning him in? None at all. I should have known better than to take up with him in the first place. But what can I say? I was dumb. I let myself get taken in by his charm. Charm? Hmm, what's up? Techni, Muse of Progress. Not a bad gig. Audie got it for me. It's my entree into respectability. Listen, I've got a proposal for you. I have this friend, right? No dice. I'm only seeing Audie now. It's not like that. See, my friend's in a relationship with Edna Strickland. Oh, poor schmuck. I wouldn't wish her on anyone. Then you see where I'm coming from. He won't listen to reason, but I thought she might call it off if she thought he and you were, you know. Ah, you are an evil imp, ain't ya? Sometimes a guy's got to resort to underhanded tricks. What do you say? Sorry. Ah. Oh. Edna oh. might be a pill, but if I play dirty tricks on every dame who disapproves of me, well, well, I'd, I'd play a lot of dirty tricks. Besides, such stunts are beneath the dignity of Techni Muse of Progress. Ah. Look, my friend Emmett really needs help. The one who's going out with Edna Strickland? You're darn right he needs help. I'm not asking you to actually seduce him. Just make her think that you two have a thing going. It'll drive her crazy. <laughs> I guess it would. So? Uh-uh. I wouldn't do that to another girl unless I was good and mad at her. And besides, it might tarnish my image as a muse. Ah, two are going to get So, Artie's working for the expo too, huh? Oh, 
妈的，我不说。哎，一个不会啊。妈的 ，See you, Trixie. From this chamber of wonders, we bid you a fond adieu. Ah. 하면 될까? 좋은 구대. Have you figured out what's wrong with the time circuits? Not sure. Possibly. It seems to me to be a simple wiring issue, but I'm double checking to make sure all the basic equipment appears to be functional. Um, any chance I could borrow the DeLorean? I want to drop in on Young Yu at the lab. Well, I don't know. The time circuits. Listen, I promise I won't take it to 88. Even so, I'm worried about letting it out of my sight while it's still behaving unpredictably. Tell you what, I'll take it on a test drive one minute into the past. If it passes the test, I'll let you borrow it. Hi. He worked, didn't it? I'm afraid not. In fact, the discrepancy appears to be getting worse. I arrived six hours ago. Oh, too bad. I didn't want to risk undoing any of the work you've done thus far, so I kept out of sight. But the time lag wasn't entirely a waste. I stopped by the hardware store and bought the parts for a chronometric analyzer. A what? A diagnostic device. See, I plug it into the time circuits and set them to cycle. When the green light goes off, I should have the data I'll need to understand the scope of the problem. Hey, no driving the exhibits off the lot. Looks like you'll have to find another set of wheels if you want to get to the lab. You got a job. Amy, come to the lab. Tower is required. Oh, what? If I'm gonna get to Emmett's, I need to find some wheels. Oh, 타고갈 만한 게 필요하다. 타고갈 거 여기 있지. 자동차. 이거 뭐? 미래의 기차. 오. 왠지 꼬, 끌렸어. My future wouldn't be built so shoddily. Uh, hi, Miss Strickland. I was just break what you like, Mr. Crockett. It's no skin off my nose. Just keep away from Emmett's booth. Speaking of whom, I better go see what's keeping him. Um. I'll go check on him for you. I was just heading there anyway. No, you weren't. The last thing he needs is another distraction at the eleventh hour. But tut tut. Not another word. I've got the rest of the day all mapped out, Miss Strickland. I'm sorry, I don't recognize you. Heavens, you've shaved off your hair, but Carl Sagan? I'd like a word with you, if I may. I'm not sure it would be seemly for me to be seen in the company of an alleged <laughs> arsonist. I think it may be in your best interest. You see, I know what you're up to. Let's go somewhere where we can talk privately. Go. I'll keep her occupied till you get back. I 너무 잘 찾는 거 아니야? 어떤 거는 그냥 한 방에 그냥 찾아버려. 스케이드보드 좋았어. Hang on, Emmett. Hope you're ready for a big breakup. 저 자동차가 위험한데? Damn it! Thanks again for your assistance, Detective Parker. Detective? What the hell is Kid doing here? Nothing criminal, I assure you. I was just getting a mind map of Mr. Tannen for our exhibition at the Expo. The authorities wouldn't allow Edna and I to stage a demonstration of the mental alignment meter with a violent felon, but this little baby is just as good. Okay, let's see now. What's next? Check the stew. Sort the maps. Ooh, I almost forgot that. Edna really is cracking the whip, isn't she? Well, yes, but she's got my best interests at heart. Without her, I can get so distracted. 
Did she send you down here to check up on me? Uh, yeah, she wanted to come herself, but... She's busy too, I know. Well, you're a poor substitute for Edna's lovely features, but make yourself at home. Thanks. No thanks are necessary. Without you, I'd never be where I am now. In love with a woman of my dreams. And a mere six hours from my first public triumph as a scientist. Wait a minute. Six hours? Jumping Jehoshaphat, I'm running out of time! Ah, Edna는 왜 오버슈이 아닌 것처럼 보이지 않대? 아, 좀 어렵겠는데. 아, 뭔지 대충 알것 같기도 해. 추억이. I don't care about Trixie Trotter. Edna doesn't approve of that sort of music, but I find it very soothing. Ah. How does the mental alignment thing work? Here, I'll show you. Hey, the test subject wears this mind mapping helmet, which probes the brain by measuring fluctuations in skin conductance and electrical resistance on the surface of the parietal lobe. Uh huh. When I turn on the mind mapping helmet with this radio switch, the subject is exposed to a series of visual stimuli intended to provoke a series of positive or negative responses as indicated by these lights on the helmet. Hey, is that? As the responses are recorded, they're relayed to this special typewriter which prints out a punch card that represents the subject's mind map. All I see is a bunch of holes. Well, uh, to you, maybe. But to our mental alignment meter, this mind map is nothing less than a peek into your subconscious. Observe, as I place your mind map into the M.A.M. <laughs> hey, about. Is that machine calling me a slacker? No, your own physiological responses did. Ah. 저걸 어떻게 만들면 될것 같아요? 수족관. How goes the bacteria farm? Not so hot. The bacteria have kind of gotten out of control. I had to put a clamp on the nitrogen tube to keep the stench from flooding the lab. 꼭다리, 밸브. Phew. Ugh. Did the clamp fall off again? Um, yeah. Put it back on. Huh. Well, I don't even know why I keep that bacteria tank around. Every time the clamp falls off the nitrogen tube, it takes a couple of minutes before I can get the stench out of the air. Whew. Oh, I guess so. What's this typewriter do again? During a mental alignment test, it takes messages from the mind map helmet and turns them into punch cards. Like the one for Mr. Tannen over there. Seems complicated. Actually, it was all rather easy to put together. Once Edna gave me the idea. Sounds to me like you should be working on harder problems then. What? Uh, sorry, I've got to get back to work. Hmm. What's Oh, what's that? So this machine takes those little cards and tells you whether or not someone's a good guy or bad guy? Kind of. Actually, the helmet does all the work. The mental alignment meter is just a glorified arcade machine. So why not just go with the cards? And it says that people respond well to flashing lights and snap judgments. I can't argue with that. Every time I kiss her, I see flashing lights and lose all sense of judgment. No kidding. Hmm. What's this? The mind map cards from the dozens of subjects I've tested during the last few weeks. I've got to get them sorted before the expo begins. Why? Edna's got this grand scheme to catalog all of Hill Valley citizens by their mental alignment. Isn't mm. that cute? Not really. Hello. I'd be careful of that if I were you. Why? The rocket fuel experiment must have stripped one of the teeth in the hand crank. As a consequence, if you turn it for more than 10 seconds, it... No! ...sends out an electric shock. Okay. <laughs> if I'm gonna take Emmett's mind map, I better replace it with another one. 
Uh-huh. Hey Emmett, got a sec? Why yes. In fact, I've got several. Mm. Hey, what's with the new threads? You like them? You look like Colonel Sanders. Who? Never mind. <laughs> Edna gave them to me. She says my usual clothes don't have enough zing for a public exhibition. <sighs> Can't believe you invented all this in two months. Well, like I said, there's not really a whole lot of inventing going on here. I just dressed up a $5 potentiometer with a lot of bells and whistles. But... Don't get me wrong, it does a remarkable job of telling whether a subject is currently liking or disliking what they're experiencing. But all the extra stuff about sorting out criminals from model citizens is mostly a bunch of hooey at this point. Ah, you go tell them all together. How are things between you and your father? I'm kind of surprised he hasn't torn down your lab yet. Well, he's still angry with me and threatening to cut me out of his will, but I'm hoping that the civic potential of my mental alignment meter will win him over. What do you say we take a break for a couple of hours and go see a movie? A couple of hours? Actually, it may be more like 70 minutes. I haven't got a couple of hours. I still got all these mind maps to sort, and the MAM's wiring is still giving me fits, and... I get it, you're busy. You sure you don't want to take in a movie? I think you'll like it. Strange as it may sound, I've got more pressing things to think about than going out to movies. Hmm. Okay. You look busy. Why don't we talk later? Sure thing. Oh. I don't think so. Maybe not. Hey Emmett, what's cooking? That's an old brown family recipe for Hassenpfeffer. Hassenpfeffer? Rabbit stew. The trick is to add the cumin an hour after the carrots. Take a whiff. Ew. Mm, isn't that just about the best thing you've ever smelled in your life? It's, um, powerful, yeah. I've got it on a slow boil for later. Oh, gone down that way. Mind if I... Go ahead. <laughs> ah, that'd be Mr. Needleman's card. I'll just put this in the stack with the other hooligans. Hmm, it's interesting. What's this? It's the placard we'll be putting in front of our booth at the expo. The scientist that caught Kid Tannen? A small exaggeration, but Edna says it'll attract investors. What do you think of the picture? Uh, you look a little... constipated. What? Edna said I looked intense. Yeah, intensely focused on taking it. I get the picture. Hmm. I'll have to find a better one. Unfortunately, there's a lot to choose from. Heavy. Extremely. Mother has been rather obsessive about photographically cataloging my life. Selfie mania, selfie mania. If I'm gonna take Emmett's mind map, I better replace it with another one. Hey Emmett, I've got an idea. What? Why don't I take your photo album over to Edna so she can pick out your new picture? That's a great idea. She's got a better eye for these things than I do anyway. Thanks, pal. Don't mention it. <laughs> Emmett says this album has pictures of him all the way back to when he was a baby. I don't want I don't think Emmett would appreciate using his childhood photos like that. Hmm. Hmm. Looks like you got a lot of hooligans. 
Yeah, about 90% of Hill Valley thus far. It's a little disturbing. Okay. Looks like you got a lot of hooligan. Yeah. According to Emmett, this thing prints out mind maps. According to Emmett, this thing prints out mind maps. Not sure what that'll do. Not sure what that'll do. Slide in. Nothing happened. Well, that button advances the slides during the mind mapping test. It only works while the test is running. Ew. Oh, draw, draw. Switch. This button only works while the mind map test is active. Yeah, Oh,我，那我呢？嗯，天才了。哈，我忘记你呢，哪里了？我，哦，一堆人，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他
Oh, I agree. You do? Like all independent women, she's a danger to the patriarchal status quo. That's one of the things I love about her. She shakes things up. You have no idea. <laughs> Don't you think she's a little uh, controlling? Controlling? Edna? No, 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 no. She's just giving me a little much needed guidance. Before I met her, I was such a flibberty gibbet. Always getting distracted by the slightest stray idea. But now, thanks to Edna, I stay focused on the task in front of me, like a narrow band stream of stimulated photon emissions. Hmm. Focused! Isn't she a little uh, cold? Don't let the school marm exterior fool you, buddy. Edna's got enough warmth to raise a liter of water from zero to a hundred degrees centigrade. Know what I mean? I kind of wish I didn't. <laughs> I just think you should be careful, that's all. Thanks for the concern, but I'll be fine. I still don't think Edna's right for you. Oh? And who is she right for? You? Me? No way. Relax. I'm just yanking your tibia. Oh, come on, Raguso. Hmm. You get back to work. We'll we'll catch up later. Thanks. What's this? That's a can of used motor oil, rocket fuel waste, and assorted chemical sludge left over from my abandoned rocket car. Gross. Accounting doesn't enter into it, but it is disgusting. Would you mind disposing of it on your way out? Uh, sure. Hmm. Ah. Bianajiman. Will come to Kantanaki. I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. Hey, Emmett, I've got a. Whoa! <laughs> Whoops. What the heck? Oh, geez, I'm sorry. Your, your suit's ruined. Edna's gonna be royally PO'd. Wrong! What? When Edna gave me this suit, I realized that the probability of me keeping it clean was infinitesimally remote, so I spent a few hours whipping up this. Whoa! What was that? A chemical compound capable of wiping the grime off any surface. Damn it, you'll make a fortune. Not anytime soon, I'm afraid. Due to an inerrant instability in its molecular makeup, after 12 oh, hours, the cleanser's component chemicals break down into a series of claw shredding enzymes, rendering it unsuitable for commercial use. Wait a minute, does that mean your suit's gonna dissolve in 12 hours? Hey gods, no. The solution dissipates into the air after it's applied. But it does mean that after this batch of cleanser ages another 11 hours and 53 minutes, it would eat away this suit faster than a thousand starving moss. And that would be a crisis of unimaginable proportions. Why? Because this suit belongs to Edna's grandfather, who wore it on his wedding day. Poor guy was gunned down just a few years later. Emmett? Well, enough wool gathering. Back to work. Hmm. That cleanser doesn't seem very portable. It isn't, but this is. A perfume bottle? Yes. No. I mean, yes, it's a perfume bottle, but inside is a concentrated dose of my all-purpose cleanser. With a little luck, this should last me through the next 12 hours before its component chemicals break down into a series of cloth-destroying enzymes. Yeah, Clever. What the hell is that? What? Sorry, I, I thought I saw a tarantula. Hmm. <laughs> That doesn't need cleaning. 
Yo, yo, yo. And I'd better not return it yet. I might need it to clean something. If only this stuff was several hours older, I could use it to dissolve Emmett's suit. Hmm. More harshies. So after 12 hours, your cleanser just kind of turns into battery acid? Battery acid? Don't be ridiculous. It merely turns into a brew of cloth-destroying enzymes capable of rotting away any fabric almost instantly. <laughs> battery acid, really? I want to say So after 12 hours... Hmm. I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. Hmm. I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. Nah. That doesn't need cleaning. Ew. <웃음> 아, 저걸 찍어야 되는데. 음. 뭉치. Looks like you got a lot of hooligans. Yeah, about mm. 어, 훔칠 만한 거 없나? 훔쳐가 그렇게 도움이 되는 거야. 에미트의 Motor oil is a Wow. I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. Yeah. I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. This thing reads Emmett's mind maps. This thing reads Emmett's mind maps. I don't know. The mind of a degenerate criminal. This kid Tannen's mind map, as captured by our mind map helmet. You could tell he's a criminal just by looking at this? No, but when it's fed into the mental alignment meter. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> Weird, nothing. It's science. According to Emmett, this thing prints out mind maps. What? I was just thinking about the future. All that talk about Edna's grandfather made me realize something. Please let it be something about lightning. Life can be short, sometimes brutally so. 
So why not seize the day and grab your happiness while you can? I'm not sure I like where this is going. I was saving this for next Valentine's Day, but why should I? I know what I want. Emmett, oh, no. Okay. I'm going to ask Edna to marry me right now. No. Oh, right, right. I'll wait until tonight at the expo. It'll be much more romantic that way. Just think. By this time tomorrow, Edna and I will be engaged and will be the toast of the scientific community. And I owe it all to you. You're welcome. 안 되지. 이러면 안 되는데. 오호. 이건 뭐야? 발전기. 아 이거 찍었는데 왜안 되지? 측정 감정기. 아이고 이거. This button only works while the mind map test is active. That doesn't need cleaning. Clean, clean. 청소, 냄비. That doesn't need cleaning. 그래, cleaning 필요가 없어요. 나갑시다. Hey Emmett, I've got to go out for a while. I thought Edna sent you to make sure I wasn't getting distracted. Oh, you'll be fine. What do you want to put it in? 뭐 피가 어디 있지? 원신 이건 뭐야? Furs donated by Lamont's House of Ermin. At least they're going to a good cause. They're stuck tight in this tar. 아, 얘구나. 요즘 청소가 필요할 것 같아. It's a good thing I did this before Emmett's 12 hour time limit, where the cleanser might have dissolved the fur. Let's slip out of those furs, shall we? Ooh, it's a boy. That volcano looks a lot like the one I did for my 7th grade science fair. Hmm. Yeah. That really doesn't need the added tackiness of dead animal pelts. 어, 여기다가 기름을 화산에 터질 때 기름이 생기게. I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. 아, 컴온. 컨트롤 봅시다. 아, 머리가 안 나간다. 다 녹아 버린 됐죠. 아. 브라운 씨. 브라운 씨. 트로이안을 씌울 때마다 결과가 어떻게 됐죠? 음. 기다려 봐. 아, 뭔가, 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 그리고 이건 어디다 놔? I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. 아 오일을 어디다 뿌리면 될까? 트럭. It's not as nice as my truck back in '86. Jeez, I hope I still have a truck back in '86. 그러니까. 머리가 안 들어가네. 다시 힌트를. 아, 그래, 그래. 어, 여기 스위치가 있네. 어트. Times may be hard in Hill Valley, but our present worries fade into insignificance when we ponder our Pleistocene past.
Is the wolf knocking at your door? Be glad he's not a Tyrannosaurus, king of the ancient lizards. And if you find yourself drowning in debt, well, you could be drowning in something a whole lot stickier, like the Hill Valley Tar Pits. This peek into the distant past is brought to you by Lamont's House of Urban, reminding you, fur is forever. Fur is forever. จะทำวันชินพาสัน Sorry about the furs, guys, but you don't need them where you're going. Hmm. That volcano looks a lot like. Come on, Ted. Kongyong Park. There's something. In the middle, there's something. Oh, Mirai Jardin Shot Tent. Let's go. Come see the cars of the future. Brought to you by Statler Desoto. Hmm. 박사님 Hey Doc, I mean uh, Mr. Sagan. Excuse me a moment, Miss Strickland. I've got her neutralized for the moment. How's the plan proceeding on your end? Hmm. 이거 어떻게 설명해야 될까? 아. Is it true that you only had eyes for Edna? At that time, I'm afraid so. I always tended to idealize the opposite sex. I was educated in a boys' school, and Jules Verne was always a little sketchy with female characters. We haven't got time for a therapy session, Doc. Hmm. Horrible news, Doc. Emmett's going to ask Edna to marry him tonight. But that's not how it happened. She didn't get me to propose until much later, that night at the lake. Something I said must have caused him to move up the timetable. Great Scott! This time travel business is trickier than I imagined. Chow, you got chow. Edna made a point of saying that teenage you look great in her grandfather's suit. I, uh, I did cut a fine figure in that suit. She hated it when I got it dirty. Maybe I could talk teenage you into losing the suit. I doubt it. I knew how much that suit meant to Edna, and at that time, my only desire was to please her. Hmm. Was Edna right when she said you had a virtuous brain? I do indeed. No criminal tendencies whatsoever. Solid citizen through and through. That's how I was able to go so far in politics. Yeah, <laughs> I'm starting to miss Kid Tannen. Oh, three are there also. Travel to the end. Carrying two. Check it, my dear. I think I'm starting to get a plan. Good. Tell me. No, no. After all, it's my history we're talking about. If I learn how you're planning on altering it, my resolve may weaken. Oh. About that gizmo you've got hooked up to the DeLorean? The chronometric analyzer? Yeah. What am I supposed to look for again? A signal that it's done evaluating the time circuits. The analysis can take a while. Be sure to let me know when the light turns green, and I'll take her out for another test run. Hmm? It's about Edna. Don't worry, she's not going anywhere right now. That's good, but. She isn't starting to get under your skin, is she? Heavens no! The memory of her older self wheeling me into the reconditioning chamber is just too strong. The younger version is decidedly more attractive, though. <laughs> cool. On another subject, less distasteful, I hope. Expo Dad never people. told me about a Hill Valley Expo. It was Mayor Thomas's idea. He had visions of Hill Valley becoming a magnet for big investors in the technology sector. 
But the adventure folded after the third year when the influenza exhibit leaked into the concession stand. Oh. Aha. I suggested a little scheme to Trixie, but I don't know if she's going to go along with it. Pursue whatever strategies you like, but please don't tell me the details. Ah, okay, okay. Renji. Chante. I don't have any reason to give furs to Trixie. Ah, choose up to all who will pro what's cooking ideas up here ah see you Trixie don't be a straight hey Artie hey mr. G man how's the uh, undercover operation if everything goes as planned we should be wrapping things up real soon now. Well, when it's time for me to play my part, just say the word. Hi, Gigi. Trixie was cool. Like Trixie's new outfit. Cost the expo $14.89, but it was worth every penny. After all, she's the public face of the expo. Techni. Muse of progress. 그 당시 때 15, 15 불이면, 어우, 엄청, 엄청날 것 같아요. So you're the registration guy for the expo? And chief accountant and paymaster. Hey, you're coming up in the world. And none of it would have happened if I hadn't responded to that subpoena. <laughs> you haven't met Grand, I mean, Sylvia yet, have you? My contact person? Not yet. Is he or she? At the expo? I don't think so, and I'm pretty sure it'll be a she. Keep your eyes open for Sylvia. What should I do when I meet her? Just let nature take its course. <laughs> I don't suppose you miss working for Kid Tannen? No sorry, Bob. I don't know how I ever got mixed up with an abusive, gun-toting thug like that. He even stiffed me on overtime pay. Yeah. I think the Hill Valley Expo will be a success. I don't see why not. Why shouldn't California have its own high technology center? Huh. <laughs> Keep doing what you're doing, Grandpa. Grandpa? Uh, that's our uh, code name for you. Oh, ha! <laughs> Funny. Yeah? When does the Expo not open? Ah. Mm. Aha. I'm not giving these first to her. Ah. Ah. I probably shouldn't show Emmett's baby pictures around to complete strangers. What? I probably ah, should. Ah, okay, okay, okay. I'm not sure why Trixie won a photo album of the Brown family. Yeah. Oh. Doc said to tell him when the light on his diagnostic thingy went green. Hey, the light's green. That means Doc could take the DeLorean out again. Ah, I thought that's a Doc said I need to talk to you. Excuse me, Mike. Yes? Not that gizmo you've got hooked up to the DeLorean? The chronometric analyzer? Yeah, the light's gone green. Wonderful. If the systems check out, I should be able to take it for another test run. I've got to run a short end, Miss Strickland. I suggest you think about what I've been saying. 
Oh, I will. When did you land this time? Nine hours and 37 minutes ago. Ouch. Frankly, it started to get a little difficult to avoid running into myself. Still, the time jump yielded some interesting new data on the flux field. I'll run some more tests and we'll see what we find. Nope, no green light yet. Ah, 12 hours. Doc's trip aged the formula a few hours. Not enough to turn it to acid, though. Ah, I'm done now. I'm gonna have to go to the next Hinter. Kidare denda. Ah, Tatenda. Baki. But the best in Nico. Tejanasika. Nope, no green light yet. Ah, nope, no green light yet. Arar. Doc's trip aged the formula a few hours. Not enough to turn it to acid, though. Nope, no green light yet. Aha! Hey, the light's green. I need to talk to you. Yes? Your chronometer's gone green again. Excellent. Let's hope this time I test I'm sorry to desert you again. Yes, well, you've left me with plenty to think about. Yeah, any luck this time? Depends what you mean by luck. My arrival time is off again. By how much? Eight hours this time. Gave me the chance to take in three showings of Frankenstein. Good movie. A bit implausible from a scientific perspective, but I can see how my younger self would have been mesmerized. But what about the DeLorean? Oh, yes. I did get one critical piece of information. The chromium elements in my circuits became unstable during the temporal shift. I should replace them with titanium. Great! Now, unfortunately, titanium won't become commercially available till the coal process is perfected in nine years. Nine years? But there may be another solution. I'm going to fire up the chronometric analyzer again. Then, while I'm stalling in there, you can... Uh-oh. Where did it go? The lab! Ah! You better get down there before she makes the situation impossible. I'll tend to the DeLorean. Age to perfection. Oh, hey, Abbott, I'm back. 